Welcome to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are having one very interesting and challenging problem from exponential equations. And this question we have solved earlier also, but today we will be solving in different way. Equation is 4 power x plus 24 power x equal to 144 power x. And we have to find out real solutions only. Let's consider all the terms to one side first. So I will be writing 4 power x minus 144 power x plus 24 power x equal to 0. Now we can write 4 as 2 square whole power x, 144 as 12 square whole power x and 24 we can factorize as 2 times 12 whole power x. Now I will write two powerful exponent properties. Property number 1, a power b whole power c can be written as a power c whole power b. Switching in the exponents. Property number 2, a times b whole power is x. Then we can write equal to a power x times b power x. Let's apply both the properties here. So I can switch these two powers. Here also we can switch these two powers using property number 1. So I will be writing 2 power x whole square minus 12 power x whole square. Then using property number 2, I will write this 2 power x times 12 power x equal to 0. Now I will use substitution. Let's consider 2 power x equal to a and consider 12 power x equal to b. So our equation will convert into a square minus b square plus ab equal to 0. Now I will use one manipulation step. I will multiply this equation with 4, both sides. So left hand side we can write it as 4a square minus 4b square plus 4ab and right hand side 0. Let's say split 4b square in this way 4a square 4b square we can write plus b square minus 5b square 1 minus 5 is minus 4 plus 4ab equal to 0. Let's consider these terms in one bracket 4b square plus b square plus 4ab. 4a square plus b square plus 4ab. In second bracket, we will be writing 5b square. Right hand side is 0. Now we can write our first bracket term as 2a whole square. It is 4a square. b square is b whole square. Same thing. Plus we can write 4ab as 2 times 2a times b. Now this bracket is close minus 5b square equal to 0. Now you can see it is a square plus b square plus 2ab formula written. So this is one perfect square of 2a plus b. Now I will write 5b square as one perfect square of root 5 times b whole square. Trying to convert this equation into difference of two squares form. Now I can apply a plus b a minus b formula. So I will be writing 2a plus b plus root 5b. And then I will be writing 2a plus b minus root 5b equal to 0. f dot g equal to 0. That means either f equal to 0. So we can write 2a plus b 
प्लस रूट फाइव बी इक्वल टू जीरो और टू ए प्लस बी माइनस रूट फाइव बी इक्वल टू जीरो सो वी हैव टू इक्वेशन फ्रॉम देयर वी विल कैलकुलेट टू सोल्यूशन लेट्स कंसिडर वन बाय वन सो आई कैन टेक बी कॉमन फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट इक्वेशन सो इट विल बी वन प्लस रूट फाइव टाइम्स बी इक्वल टू जीरो I will take two a to the RHS. So one plus root five times b equal to minus two a. Or straight away we can write b over a value as minus two over one plus root five. It is reminding to us golden ratio. It is reciprocal of golden ratio without sign. So we can write this is minus one over five. Root five plus one over two. So b over a is coming out negative first one, and it is reciprocal of golden ratio. Now let us write the second equation also. So two a plus b minus root five b equal to zero. Let's take b term to the RHS. So I will write two a. Equal to, I will write root five b minus b. Two a equal to root five minus one times b. So I can write b over a as it will become two over root five minus one. So we have calculated two standard formulas for our such kind of exponential equations straight away we can put the value of b and a as b is the square of rhs in the base and a is the square of lhs in the base and simply we will get the result directly now let's solve let's put back the value of b and a b was 12 power x a was 2 power x Let's put one by one. So I will write b over a equal to minus two over root five plus one. Okay, so twelve par x divided by two par x equal to minus two over root five plus one. Now we know the property a over b. Whole power x. If it is written, then we can write a power x divided by b power x. So it is from RHS to LHS. So we will write 12 over 2 whole power x equal to minus 2 over root 5 plus 1, which we can write 6 power x is equal to minus 2 over Root five plus one. So this two over root five plus one is always positive. Six par x cannot be negative for real solutions. So here we will reject this equation for our solution, as we are calculating real solutions. Because six par x is always positive. Now let's consider the second equation. So it is b over a equal to two divided by root five minus one. So I can write it straight away six par x equal to two divided by root five minus one. So now we have to consider log both sides. So I will consider log six par x equal to log. 2 over root 5 minus 1 now i will write two log properties first property is log a par b this b will come as a multiplier log a this is first property second property of log is log a over b any time we can write log a minus log b 
so let us consider our equation it was log 6 power x equal to log 2 divided by root 5 minus 1 so i will apply both the properties property number 1 and 2 so i can write x log 6 with base 10 it is equal to log 2 minus log root 5 minus 1 now i can write x log 6 equal to log 2 let's write its value or let me write first log root 5 is 2.236 minus 1 so 1.236 so i can write it as 0 0.3010 minus log 1.236 is 0 0.092 and if you will check this value this value is approximately 0 0.209 now this is equal to x log 6 once i will divide both sides with log 6 so it will be 0 0.209 divided by log 6 if i will put this value 0 0.209 log 6 value is 0 0.778 and if you will simplify this answer is coming about 0 0.268 so our ultimate and final answer is x is equal to 0 0.268 i hope friends this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video Good luck and take care of yourself.